Clock radio puts the light literally at your fingertips. Just reach over and wave your hand over the clock radio. Nothing but a simple gesture. <laughs> you don't need to patronize me that. <laughs> a simple dial on the front lets you set the amount of light that you need. No adjustment, no blinding flash when it wastes your space. The RCA light clock radio also features USB charging for mobile devices. It will be available this April for a suggested retail price of $24.99. Now to remote controls. RCA has a long history as a category leader. We've kept our leadership position by keeping a simple truth in mind. Home entertainment is about more about the device, is not is about more than devices and gadgets. And a remote control is a key part to this home. Wouldn't it be great to have a remote control that's not only easy to clean, but is actually designed to protect itself from dust and debris? RCA has the answer, including the Clean Shield Universal Remote. Its smooth surface lets you wipe away spills, residue, and other, shall we say, more mysterious substances that you'll probably find in your hotel room. Uh, yeah, you guys are in the gutter. The Clean Shield also protects itself with an outer membrane that prevents dust and debris from settling in between the keys. It's a simple remote that's easy to clean, available in a two-device option in March for $9.99. RCA has also stayed in front of the pack of, pack of remotes as new components have come to market. The introduction of streaming players is a challenge we met head-on several years ago by being the first remote manufacturer by supporting streaming codes in universal remotes. Now we've taken it a step further with a universal two-device replacement remote for streaming players. Everything for this new streaming centric home theater is there, and a design as simple and streamlined as possible, and a form factor that owners of things like Roku, boxes, and Apple TVs will find familiar. Engineered <coughs> to give you complete control in just a few key premises, the RCA two-device universal streaming remote control will be, will be available this April at an MSRP of $12.99. The other core category I need to speak to is digital reception. Since even before the digital transition in 2009, RCA and Turk have been leading the way in digital TV reception with a patented 360-degree reception technology and groundbreaking designs. And now, nearly a half decade after the tr digital transition, the market for reception products is actually still growing, with new consumers just discovering the benefits and unrivaled quality of digital over-the-air television cord cutters, streamers, secondary TVs, millions of consumers have dozens of reasons to buy a digital TV antenna. And recent disastrous storms in New York, New Jersey, and Northeastern United States have highlighted perhaps the most important reason for getting a digital TV antenna, safety. Storms can easily knock out cable or satellite signals for long periods of time. If you've got cable or satellite, you need a backup plan. Digital TV antennas keep you prepared so that if you lose your paid programming signal, you can still stay informed of what's going on around you. Both RCA and Turk are making it easier than ever to enjoy the reliability, unbeatable picture, and freedom of over the air signals. It's the same revolutionary design of our existing digital reception line, but slimmer with improved reception through a larger surface area. Our new RCA slim digital antennas will be available this April in both amplified and non-amplified versions for suggested retail price of $79 and $59 respectively. The new Turk Slim Amplified Digital Antenna will also be available this April at an MSRP of $119.99. And in addition to these new Slim Antennas, we at Box Accessories are proud to announce a new partnership. We're announcing today that we are part of the Roku Ready program. Roku is the leading provider and innovator in streaming with a line of award-winning products. We at Box Accessories are the market leader in over-the-air <coughs> digital TV reception. Together, we are developing the industry's first integrated digital antenna with Roku streaming capability. This new Roku Ready digital antenna will allow consumers to receive their over-the-air HD broadcast signals and streaming entertainment from the Roku platform, which includes 500 plus channels of entertainment, including Hulu, Netflix, Crackle, and more. We believe the marriage of the two will create an exciting product for consumers who are looking for an innovative way to receive their TV entertainment. Look for the new digital antenna with Roku streaming in the fourth quarter of 2013 under the RCA and Turk brands. 
So as you can see, we've got a lot to add to the party with this year's CES. But I also want to remind everyone that for Box Accessories, it's not just about addition and about having more. It's about simplifying, making everyday tasks easier. It's about saving time and energy and offering value where consumers are not getting their money's worth. So I thank you. It's now my pleasure to introduce Tommy Ian, thank you, and I'm burning every remote in my room as soon as I get back. <laughs> we'll never watch TV in a hotel again. <laughs> but now it's why we're here. As you can see our tagline and know where you're headed, you gotta know where you've been, just to give you a quick background. I've been with Audiobox for 25 years, almost half the life of the company. When I joined Audiobox, I was told by many that it was the end of the mobile electronics industry and the car manufacturers were going to take over car audio, and uh, this business was very short-lived. It wasn't the end, but the beginning of a period of change and innovation that fueled our industry for the next 25 years. <coughs> we are again at another crossroads in mobile electronics, with core categories maintaining flat sales at best or decreasing sales at worst. Just like 25 years ago, this is not the end of mobile electronics, but the beginning of a new era of growth and innovation. Technology is moving faster today than it ever has, and we plan on taking advantage of the opportunities these changes provide. I would now like to introduce you to the products that are going to drive our mobile electronics growth this year in 2013. Let me make sure this is on. John? Everybody hear me? Yeah. Okay, don't like podiums. Um, so again, this is all about change. And what we're going to introduce you today is where mobile electronics, uh, the industry is going. It is a very different business than it was years ago, and it is going to continue to be a different business. And we're very excited to usher in new categories, new technologies that are going to drive this growth. Uh, we're going to introduce you to our four first products in rear view mirror navigation, Wireless charging, which we think is a very exciting category, Siri head view compatibility, and iPad vehicle mounts. So the first product we're going to talk about is rear view navigation. Of course, everybody knows where the portable navigation business is going. Uh, sales continue to drop in that category. In-vehicle navigation is expensive uh, to put in your vehicle, and there are some great options. And one of the things we love about embedding the navigation in the mirror it is in your best viewing angle when you are driving the, view, uh, the vehicle. But some of the unique things about our system are we have Igo Primo software, uh, one of the best navigation softwares in the industry, but we also have an exclusive turn-by-turn -turn feature that we develop with Igo. What that means is when you are ready to make a turn and the system knows a command is coming, it is going to turn on your screen and it's going to show you that turn and it's going to tell you about the turn and then it's going to shut off. It's going to come on again at the next turn. So you're not constantly looking at a navigation screen unless you choose to. You have a default mode where you can put it where you want to look at it all the time or just about when a command is given, which we found to be a great feature. We also have lane assist. So as you see on the most expensive OE systems, Mercedes, BMW, you see a lane marker on one, two, three, whichever of the lanes you're designated to go on. We have lane assist built into the system, along with 3D graphics as well. And of course, one of the best things is this is a Bluetooth system. So now you can pair your phone to the system, use all your Bluetooth capabilities, have it built into the mirror with the nav, a, an affordable, unique solution to combine nav, Bluetooth, into a uh, product that is positioned perfect for utilizing your navigation system. We also have a backup camera input. And as everybody knows, backup cameras are uh, in the news all the time, that the OEs are very slow in, in putting in this capability for child safety. We support that industry initiative very strongly. And again, we put that capability into this product as well. So as soon as you go in reverse, the image is going to come up right where you want to see it, right in front of your eyes, not looking down where you may not notice it. 
So a very multi-featured capable product. Uh, we're very interested or very excited to uh, introduce the NM100. In addition, we have our wireless charger. This, for everybody, you know, wireless is becoming a ubiquitous term. Everything needs to be wireless. But as Ian said, we're still connecting our devices left and right. In our homes, in our office, in our car, there's cables everywhere. I think we have 100 charging cables in my house, and uh, that's going to change. And with the advent of smart wireless charging, we're bringing our first solution to the vehicle. And with our wireless charging, you have no connections. It utilizes the Qi technology. It's QI, pronounced Qi. This is the most accepted wireless capability or technology out there. It allows you to get in your car, drop your phone on the stand, it locks it in with a spring-loaded mechanism, and your phone is charging. That's all you have to do. There is a home accessory. You can plug it into 110, have this capability at home. So no more tethering, no more, more hooking up to the unit. Just drop it on the charger, and you're ready to go. So we're very, very excited about the feel of, of wireless charging uh, in particular. And as you can see, some applications on the dashboard. It's a very small 12 volt power device, plugs into the cigarette lighter, can also be hardwired, and comes with a home accessory so you can buy another one to keep it on your kitchen counter, drop your phone on there. What's unique about Qi is you do not have to position it perfectly in the center of the device. By the multi-coil approach, it can be loosely uh, sitting on the, on the surface and it's going to give you full charging capability. So we see this wireless charging moving into the OE space. In fact, Toyota launched recently. Other car makers are launching as well. So think about it in the future. You get into your car, you open up your center console, or there's a, a little bin there. You're just going to drop your phone in there. You're pretty much done. This is the beginning. This is where it's going. And wireless charging, we think, is going to be one of those categories that is going to fuel and drive the growth of the mobile electronics industry. <coughs> we now have Siri enabled. So for many of you who have gone to our conferences, as you know, we take a different approach to car audio. We do have our Jensen brand, typical retail aftermarket car audio, but we also have developed a unique group of OE styled radios that essentially replace the lower function radio in an OE vehicle with a high function multimedia system that retains the look of the vehicle's uh, dashboard and architecture within the car. So from where we were last year, we had a handful of applications. You now see we have Toyota, Jeep, Dodge, Chrysler, GM, Ford, Hyundai, Mazda, Honda, Subaru, and Volkswagen. This is a great opportunity for the mobile electronics retailers and the car dealers to upgrade at the car dealer level a basic function radio to a radio with touchscreen, multimedia, USB, iPad, DVD, all the features that you want, iPod connectivity. In addition, what we have that the OE does not have is the ability to utilize the Siri features wirelessly from your iPhone. So your iPhone can be in your glove box and you can, through our push to talk on your steering wheel control or on the touchscreen, open up your link with Siri, pull up all your music, your navigation, whatever content that you would normally do, and Siri and your iPhone can be locked in your, in your glove box. So again, this is a capability that because of the way the OE radios are constructed from GM, Ford, Chrysler, and others, this is virtually impossible today. With our OE radios, you can utilize the Siri function, which everybody loves, uh, as soon as you put your car, uh, your uh, uh, phone in the vehicle, and it's completely wireless. And that's across our entire fleet of OE radios. iPads, certainly a lot of them out there, right? Well, people are using them all over the place, but again, another great environment is the car. So we've developed vehicle-specific uh, vehicle mounting kits for both iPad, and as you'll see in a minute, for iPad Mini. These are well-designed vehicle systems that are designed to work in the car. They're not home systems that are adapted to the vehicle. They are not systems that strap onto the back. As you can see, it snaps into a mount that goes on the uh, post 
of the headrest and use all your iPad capabilities right in front of you. You can flip it either way with the docking stand for home use as a regular stand for your iPad. As you saw before, we have an undercounter where you can snap it into the undercounter, full audio system, all iPad capabilities, wherever you want it, and you can flip it.